I-70 left impassable and unrecognizable after not one but two mudslides covered a portion of the interstate over the weekend. For each of the mudslides that have taken place, we do know that they've taken place because specifically of rain that's come down in those areas. The rain isn't good for the Grizzly Creek burn scar. It was the reason some drivers got stranded in Colorado over the weekend. like a bunch of mud, you know, dripping down the side. They're still trying to clean up everything, you know, going westbound. Alexandria Finney and her husband had to spend the night in a hotel due to the closure. As soon as we get to the exit to take the detour, they're like, um, it's open, it's open. So we're like, oh, finally, it's finally open. The couple makes the drive to Colorado weekly from California, but this was the first time they were detoured. I just didn't expect to stay overnight, you know, because we were supposed to be back home yesterday. CDOT says they're working with their crews to determine ways to make the cleanup more efficient so they are better prepared for those storms. Our teams are really kind of getting a sense for how to clear up this kind of soupy, gooky material that uh, isn't necessarily as straightforward as rocks, for example. With heavy rain in the forecast, CDOT is warning drivers to expect possible closures. That's why we're trying to get there, you know, during the um, during the day. As CDOT works to keep crews prepared and people safe. If you do end up in a small mud flow of some kind, please stay in your car. That is the most safe place to be if there is an event of some kind. I'm Darius Johnson for Nine News.